today we're going to be grinding for the new player of the month carlos correa card hoping to get the program entirely done if we can we got stage one that we need to do first with some moments and missions that we can do to get this brandon crawford card for that stage one so we're going for 692 or more likes on the video feel free to subscribe if y'all are new on the road to 60,000 subscribers if we had that before june 1st we're giving away 100 dollars feel free to follow on any of those social medias if you guys want to use code twin on controlfreak.com comment down below maybe your thoughts on these rewards this program the correa i think it's a sick card there's a prestige version of him that i'll show in just a second as well and i'm definitely excited to try to get this card try to debut him try to try him out for y'all thank you guys so much specifically for 57,000 subscribers just the support recently has been insane i can't thank you guys enough just in general too man you guys make my days better every day you make me happier every day so thank you so much for that and thank you so much for 57,000 subscribers now if we go to the moments for the monthly awards you guys can see they're divided by the players so we're going to be doing the brandon crawford ones right now first one's on veteran three games eight hits three extra base hits brandon crawford with one base hit second at bat of the first game gonna do our best to get some extra base hits and just overall get more hits though here in the first game there we go that's gonna be an extra base hit right yeah there we go we needed that if my runner actually goes to third he should all right, there we go, guys. One extra base hit, second hit of the first attempt. And three hits in the first attempt. I thought he was going to make a diving catch. Three hits in the first game isn't bad, so we need five more hits and two more extra base hits. And perfect, perfect base hit. If he goes home, then I can... Okay, so I'm, I'm hoping this is an extra base hit. I think it should be. I really want it to be. We'll see, though. All right, yeah, it is. So we need four more hits, one more extra base hit here. There it is, baby. There's that extra base hit. Three more hits to go here between the rest of this game and then that third game. And what? two hits to go, right? I'm pretty sure. I think two hits to go. Let's go. Wow, a perfect, perfect line out. Well, we're going to have to get the final two hits in the last game. Good start. All right, guys, rest of the game to get one more hit. If I somehow fail this, I'll be sad. There we go. There it is. All right, perfect. All right, so next moment, one game. We need three hits, including one extra base hit. First attempt, good start. I think. Yeah, there's the extra base hit. There we go. Come on, baby, get through. Yeah, so third at bat's going to be our second hit. We just need one more hit now. Fifth at bat, and we get the hit. Okay, there we go. So this next one, another multi-game moment, man. Okay, that's the last multi-game one for Brandon Crawford. Three games, tally 10 total bases. Good start, please home run yeah there we go there's four total bases on our first at bat there we go baby i hope deepest part of the park come on be a home run that'd be sick let's go it's a home run we could get a double in our next at bat and get this done on the first game oh that'd be nice and our first at bat of the second game we should get it done if i don't get to second i'm gonna be sad yo you're so slow dude no and we get it done. There we go. Bottom of the ninth inning of the second game. My fifth at bat, I'm pretty sure. Very early rolled over. We had like a good square line out and a good, good line out before that. On to the next moment. I think we have either two or three to go. I want to say two. I think there's five for each set, for each stage. And I think we've done three of them. I want to say. I'm pretty sure. So let's see. Yeah, we got two to go. Two extra base hits in one game. Hopefully these two go fast. There's the first extra base hit. First pitch we see here in the first inning. And it's a, not a home run, but it is an extra base hit, which is what we needed. And there's extra base hit number two, baby. I think. Yeah, let's go to home run. So first two at-bats, literally first two innings of the game, too. First attempt, we get it done. One more to go for Brandon Crawford, and then we have his moments done. So two hits, one extra base hit. So similar, but, you know, we only need one extra base hit now. Second at-bat of the first attempt, and it's a home run. I think. Yeah, there it is. So there's the extra base hit. Now we just need one more hit, and we get this one done as well. Top of the fifth innings should get one more at bat after this, maybe two. But let's just try to get it done on this one. And we get it done easy, right? Yeah, there we go. Two extra base hits, two home runs in this one. There we go. My uh, my my plate appearance before this one, I actually uh, 
I actually got walked. 3-0 count, and I checked my swing. I went to go around and swing so we could get a hittable pitch, but we drew a walk. So monthly awards programs may. We're at 15 out of 25. I think I am just going to do the exchange, just try to get it done as fast as possible. All right, there we go. Getting the exchange done. And Brandon Crawford is now mine. On to stage two. Same thing. We have exchanges, and then we got moments for Hector Neris. So first one, save one game, strike out two batters. We struck out the first batter, Eric Thames, striking out the second batter, Howie Kendrick. Now we need to get one Soto out, and we get this moment done. And we strike out the side. There we go. Easy enough. First moment for Hector Neris done. On to the next one. I like single game moments so much better than multi-game moments. And I'm hoping, and I like closing pitcher moments better than starting pitcher moments. So I'm hoping these are all easy. Okay, they seem pretty easy. So this is three plate appearances. We need to strike out one batter. Don't walk a batter. Don't give up a hit. Okay. And getting this one done, I actually struck out the side for this one too. So we're doing pretty well on these moments. Both of them done first attempt, both of them striking out the side. And we're on to the next one. I'm assuming there's five with him. So I think we probably have three to go with these Hector Neris moments. Yeah, one, two, three. So pitch two innings, strike out one batter. Seems easy enough. This one's on all-star. I think the first one was on all-star. Last one veteran and then this one all-star again. And getting this one done, I didn't have a strikeout until the final batter. And I got this the one strikeout I needed on the final batter. Oh, that was kind of stressful. First attempt for this one as well. But, man, I thought I was going to blow it there on that last batter, not having the strikeout. But we got it done. And we are on to the next one. Save one game. Strikeout. Th oh, I need to strike out the side. Yo, I struck out the side in the first two moments. Can I please do it here? And getting this one done on attempt number two. I actually gave up a home run to Christian Yelich. We struck on Lorenzo Cain, then gave up a home run to Yelich on my first attempt. So getting this one done on attempt number two. Still got it done pretty fast, though, and we have one moment to go for Hector Neris. I like these closing pitcher ones, man. We need to do the same thing except strike out two batters, and this one's on all-star, though, instead of veteran. And getting this one done on attempt number three. Struck out the first two guys, Matt Carpenter grinding into the shift. And we're done with Hector Neris. And we have enough to exchange for Hector Neris. Done with him. Now we are on to the moments for, I think, Derek Dietrich. Yeah, Dietrich. Good news, no multi-game moments. First moment, two extra base hits. There's the first extra base hit. Yeah, there it is, baby. And there's the second one, a moonshot. First attempt getting it done on, like, the fourth at bat, though. I struggled on a couple of them. And we're on to the next one. Next one just hit one homer on veteran. Hopefully we're facing a righty. And there's the home run, baby. All right, first attempt getting it done. Second at bat. Let's go on to the next one. Next moment, two hits, one extra base hit versus the Cubs. All-star difficulty. There's the uh, there's the extra base hit we need. It might be a home run, too. Yeah, it's gone. All right, so now we just need one more hit and we get this one done. And there's the base hit. On to the next one. Next one is two hits, one homer on veteran difficulty versus the Brewers. That's good. First hit is the home run, I think. I hope. Yeah, there we go. First hit's the home run, so now we just need one more hit. I'm pretty sure we get this one done. And there's the base hit. It's going to be a home run, so two for two, two homers. On to the final Dietrich moment. These are pretty easy so far, for me at least. I mean, I I'm sure they're probably not easy for everybody, but all the moments I'm getting done pretty fast so far. Brandon Crawford so far was the hardest. So the next one, three extra base hits in one game. Rookie difficulty, though, versus the Pirates. Well, there's the first extra base hit. <laughs> first at bat is a no doubter. Two to go. All right, so we might get another at bat in this game. I'm hoping we do because that's the second extra base hit. And oh, we get it done. Let's go, man. My final at bat of the first attempt, and we're going to get done. Perfect, baby. Three for four, two homers and a double, three extra base hits. On to the next moments, final moments for Correa. Alex Wood is going to be it, I'm pretty sure. I think the exchange is done for this one. On to the final stage. Let's see. So we got the exchanges there. So I just did an exchange to get that. So moments, five innings, strike out 11. We're going to try to get this one done first. Strike out one. Strike out two. Strike out three. There we go. Good first inning. Strike out four. There we go. That knuckle curve's nasty. And strike out five. There we go. And five strikeouts to go. Four strikeouts to go. There we go. Hey, there's another strikeout, and we have three to go. And there we go, two to go. One strikeout to go. Come on, baby. And there's the final strikeout on a pitch down the middle. And we should be getting Correa. So it took me an hour and 53 minutes. That's how long I've been recording this video for. Um, we had to do like an intro. We had the time in between and everything. But it took me less than two hours. It should have taken me about 
15 minutes less i would say but i screwed up on one of the uh the missions man i needed wins with the dodger pitcher and i didn't do that one we got it done here with uh you know alex wood being the victory and then i needed nine innings with him as well which we got in that one but i screwed up the mission and i definitely got him when i didn't uh I, I definitely got him later than i was hoping to but we got him done it took about two hours and now we could maybe debut and work towards prestige him and stuff i'm thinking his debut should probably be tomorrow we also got the new bats i'm thinking i might just equip that for now uh i oh man am i gonna have to put uh am i gonna have to put carlos correa at a secondary position we'll have to see but we got the player uh, the monthly program done i should say and then we can be working towards that prestige one right now got this program done didn't take super long i was kind of surprised the moment seemed i was i don't know about easier than the first one but they didn't seem super difficult now if we go to the prestige programs and we go to carlos correa we can see you can get a prestige version of his card as well as the red lightning bat skin from this one i, th I guess that's the same one from the didi gregorius one you could just get it from this one instead and let's just take a look at his attributes so here are 96 prestige diamond carlos correa's attributes are just everything's three higher than the normal version makes it up to a 96 second and third base secondary for the card honestly not bad at all especially because correa has a good swing i'm definitely happy to have it done my team's getting crowded though you know i'm gonna probably put him in for chipper for now but i don't know like i don't know what i want to do for my team because i want craig vigio to try to get the prestige of him mantle and sheffield i want to use this card i'm loving posey a catcher i want fame like i don't know i have too many cards now that i know what to do with but we got correa i'm hoping you guys enjoyed the video if you did be sure to leave a like subscribe comment anything down below feel free to follow on any of those social medias i will see y'all next time thank you so much for watching hope you have a fantastic rest of your day peace out